Look at that nerdy little slime. Blast that guy to goddamn bits. He deserved it. Stupid nerds. No room for nerd slimes in this tower. I want a tower of cool guy slimes only. How's it going guys? My name is Graham. Welcome to the Slime King's Tower. I was looking for something new to play and this looks like a Binding of Isaac like game and I'm always into those. There was a quick little opening cutscene of this Slime King here showing up into like a, a tavern realizing he was the only one without a mustache. He fled, built his tower and used it as a way to steal the land's super mustache powers. I will make my name Bernard, because that sounds like the name of a man who misses his mustache. And I'll just stick normal difficulty and I'll just go straight for adventure mode. Harry spelt, spelt like hair, and that looks like it's the only one I can actually use right now, the original Slime Slayer. Well, if he's the original, then I better go with that, right? All right, so basically identical uh, setup of skills to Isaac, and it even kind of like explains it in a similar opening screen. And you use guns though. I'm not gonna be crying on people. I'm literally just gonna be shooting them right in their faces. That this guy looks like he's got a clock on his face. I feel like I'm back on the old days of Newgrounds, shooting up like the clock crew or something. And a cute little bunny, and a snake that's carrying around a, a smaller snake. We'll see, I'm a big fan of Isaac, so I don't expect this game to be able to really truly compare to it. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm, I'm gonna have to make comparisons to them, it's gonna be almost impossible not to. But you know, I'm gonna have to try to be reasonable and understand that this is probably a much smaller game. I don't think I have an item, so that's not something that I'm going to do. I should find out if I can fall off the edge. I can't, so not something I need to be particularly worried about. Look at that guy dropped so much stuff. Bombs, keys, all the usual I would come to expect from a game like this. And I better blast my way through as many pots as I can to look for things. I don't know if I need to be looking for secret rooms, uh, probably. <laughs> like honestly, I'm, I'm just assuming at this point that I should be treating these at, as basically the same game. Uh, this doesn't have as clear of an art distinction. The art distinction between background and character and like prop that you can't walk through isn't as clear as it is in Isaac. I got my first treasure room. The little rocket man. The crew is growing. Oh, I got this little gun buddy. Oh, okay, he's not just a gun buddy. He's a rocket man. He shoots guns around at people. Uh, I guess it's just going to keep flying if there's nothing for it to hit. How do we get into that main boss? It's either a boss room or like a second treasure room or something. I'm not sure how I'm supposed to get into that one. Hey, the rocket followed us all the way through those several levels. And then and then came and did its thing in the new area here. And I can spend keys. I got lots of keys. I'm finding lots of keys. I can spend health to get things. Let's buy a house. The dungeon designer, it's so beautiful, that heals you. Hmm. It just shows me places where I can go get hearts, maybe? Oh yeah, you can push push things around. It's all feeling very similar. Ah, I wasn't sure what those little switches were going to be. Just a regular chest. I think the game boasted that it had... 300 items or something. It's got a it's got a nice large item count, so I'm hoping to find some some unique little things in it. I'm sure plenty of them will play and feel very very similar to an Isaac, but not all of them. Whoa, you just level up now and again. That's new and different. I also feel like I did these rooms before. I must have reset them in some way as a way to to go back and get more items and work on further upgrading. Uh, I saw in the top left there they had a little a little bar that was filling. I thought maybe I would just get like a special move or something. I wasn't expecting to level up more more like in an RPG style. So that's interesting. Ooh, let's go through this red door first. Mini boss. Well, this guy looks like he sucks. He's no slime king. He's just like a, a regular slime. He's just like a slime. He's just the cousin of the slime king or something. Well, 
That got obnoxious. How many things he, he started shooting forwards at once. I didn't just shoot a rabbit that dropped that key, did I? It looked a little bit like that rabbit dropped that key, but I think that was just coincidental timing. I'm gonna go back to here and see why, like, if I still can't go up there, right? I'm not sure what it takes. And, and that other room that I just, just did, it had a self-facing wall that I couldn't go through. I think I've cleared every room other than, like, the boss room, right? So I'm, damn. I don't know what it's gonna take. Some sort of secret, like I can show you guys what I meant here. If I go here, same thing. I can't actually go down into here. Uh, maybe I just have to chuck a bomb on it. I haven't tried using a bomb. Oh, it is all it took. I really, really expected it to take more than that. Oh, it's a, this must be a secret room then, because now you can see a blast entrance there too. Gold hearts, so those are probably like the soul hearts of Isaac, and a chest full of experience. I'm almost level three again now. I'm expecting this to go very well. Harry versus Black Slime. I mean, the last slime I fought didn't do much to stop me. Now I'm basically... Oh, he teleports. I feel like I'm basically fighting Gish. He stole stole some gold from me. No! Fucker! I didn't mean to run into the stairs there. No, I can't go back. I didn't get the item or anything. That's bogus. That sucks. I'm gonna blast my way into this room. That's not how that works. That sucks. I feel like I got so robbed. What a what a what a total complete utter waste. Oh, that guy that guy drops a bomb. But if you see in the little mini map there, there's like there's something going on. I like this rocket gunner. There's something going on in this room. Ah, it's a chest for gold though. Yeah, I don't know what else I'm gonna spend gold on, so I'll give you some gold. The hell bow range plus 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 plus. Oh well, there's a thing in the way. So I don't know quite how much plus 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 equals, but uh, I'm gonna go ahead and assume it's a lot. You little bug creatures! I don't wanna, I don't wanna deal with gross bugs. No gross bugs, please. Only cute creatures. I only wanna, I only wanna have to fight and kill the cuties. Those things look like little Metroids, uh, the little Metroid creepers, or even even like the head, head crabs from uh, from Half Life. It's the two two comparisons that come to mind right away with that. Are there any rocks that look like they have noticeable cracks in them, Isaac style? Rocks that can be blown up in order to get things. Look at that guy. He made a ro uh, a rainbow of little little things. Really, really heavily increased shot speed now. I don't I don't know. Am I just always gonna gain shot speed from level ups? Do I? Will it be a random something else? Oh, I just gave this piggy bank all my money. Hmm, well, I sure did waste a lot of money on this floor. Super big bummer, especially after not getting the weapon from the last one. Gotta doubly super make sure that I actually get it. This slime's got the face of a, a toad creature. Don't like it much. There. Oh, so you always have to take on the mini boss to get the boss key, it looks like blast our way into a secret room again and some kind of clock shaped like a turnip the time heart oh after a cer hey did I just turn it into a full time heart by yeah I got half of a gold heart and now a full time heart because of that is it a heart that I only have for a little while or after a certain amount of time it becomes permanent uh, I'll be curious to see how that plays out well <laughs> it's less likely to stick around now that I have I have no buffer very likely to take damage sometime soon here. And then that'll be the end of that. And money for this one and just a key for the other one. I do I just don't I don't uh I want this. I want whatever this like luchador outfit is, but it's not something I can do. And I have to go backwards. I think it only took a key to enter the room and the dollar sign was just letting me know that it was a shop. I thought maybe it cost money to enter, uh, but I have to go back and go to the treasure room still because I do want to make sure that I get whatever the new weapon is going to be. It's my favorite part about Isaac is loading up on new new items, and I totally botched that before, so I'm not gonna not gonna blow it for my second opportunity in a row. And there goes the time heart, lost that one. Not gonna get to know how that one's meant to behave. Bit of a fuck up, I'd say. Hey, I get to break these every time I go through. 
And hopefully something worthwhile. A shield? A little boat. Hyper bullets. No pain, no gain. What? What? I have like no range now. They just little dribbly. Look how quickly they just fall off. Maybe they do like, they gotta do crazy high damage or something though, right? Be a bit of a rip off if that wasn't how this was gonna work. Let's just go rip. Ripping our way to the final boss here. I don't have a ton of health. I think I explored everything on the level. I might have missed something. The Ghost Slime King. I wasn't expecting, like, every boss to be slimes. I think it's a little bit boring, especially when they seem to be a little bit easy. The Silver Boots. Speed up. Well, I really wish I could have got the other thing, too. Oh, I'm going up. That's another thing, is that uh, I'm in the Delta area now. I'm not just going down to the basement. I'm going up. I, I have no qualms. With this game being like the world's most blatant Isaac ripoff. I like Isaac and I like Isaac like games. It's got unique art, it's got its own. I'm sure it has some of its own things going on. I personally would love to make a game similar to this, and I know it would never stack up. You stupid fire spitting jerk. I know it would never stack up uh, against Isaac, but the least you can do is just try to make the best of it, right? Look at the look at the little mini map in the corner there. It makes me think something goes on up in that room, but not something that I can actually really deal with. So I guess I just have to move on beyond that. I haven't tried to use my space bar. I it looked like I didn't have anything, but I'm starting to think that that gray square is a item. Nope, I was wrong. It is nothing. What? Screw you guys. All right, well I'm leaving. It seemed like I couldn't actually shoot them. Ah, uh, yep, I thought that might be a spike trap. It also looked like tire treads, maybe? The more likely thing was that it was, uh, spike, spike traps. I don't know what kind of goops I can and can't stand on from what these slimes leave behind, so I just gotta stay on the more cautious side of things here. And, oh, look at all this. Am I gonna get to open all four? Very bad choice, minus 99 coins. Well. This is my least favorite room I've been to. That was uh, pretty much pure garbage. Four choices. Pretty much got like the Bowser's charity of them. The one that is secretly actually just garbage and no one should ever want. Ooh, new timed heart. Maybe, maybe this time I'll get to know. Oh, I can't get that gold coin. That sucks. And I've explored a heck of a lot of this area now. Oh shit. Not ready for that. That was neat. Getting chased off. <laughs> well, most of the enemies in this super suck. I don't know if I just have like these inherent Isaac skills that I'm able to use, or if they just suck. Is this gonna be another guy? Is this gonna run around with me? The gang. The gang. Oh, this is a. I I get to use this one. This is a space bar item, and I'm guessing I just summon summon a bunch of people. Another shot speed upgrade, along with another level up. Not a ton of health left for me. Oh right, I lost all my money, so that was a total waste of a, a key and, and time. That slime was wielding a gun, but he was only shooting to the sides, he didn't do anything with it. Well, most of the bosses in this game are just atrocious. Not a lot of balance or in that sense. I guess I'm playing on normal mode. I would like if it, it felt like there was like at least a little bit of danger or a challenge. Really, I'm just kind of breezing through things here. It's a little bit little bit uh, more of a kid's game than Isaac. Less of the weird religious themes and dead fetus babies and blood and guts and stuff. It's a more wholesome wholesome game overall. Alright, help me help me out here. Where am I trying to get to? Where Oh! Is this the boss right up top here? No, that's the boss. That's like the, the lead-in boss. I already dealt with him. I don't know why this keeps coming back. Whoa, what? What did I just do? I can I can store an item and come back and swap it? That's pretty cool. That's alright. Oh, here we go. I don't know how I missed it way off in the far, far left here. Gray Slime. He's got crazy eyes, but he's also got a helmet that I would be worried about if these bosses weren't just kind of the same every single time. Lightning Sword, though. Damage plus plus. That's the, short, that's the sort of upgrade I want. That's going to be sweet. 
Epsilon. New area. I only had to go through one delta. Oh, that guy froze me. Ooh, there's, there we go. We're starting to get into some, some more interesting uh, creatures. The time stop watch. Stop time for a little while. I think I want the gang back. That seemed like a fun item. Maybe I have to go back to that opening room there. The recharge heart. It's a battery heart. Hmm. Again, curious how that one might work out. Do I get to swap? No, that other one that I got is just gone? That sucks. I don't know what to do about that. Time stop can be useful, I'm sure, especially for like a boss battle or something. But I didn't even get a chance to try out the gang. They were all here, but I just left them waiting at the door. Doesn't do much good to have the gang all here if you're not gonna not invite them in for a little bit of drinks and rough housing. Look at that nerdy little slime. Blast that guy to goddamn bits. He deserved it. Stupid nerds. No room for nerd slimes in this tower. I want a tower of cool guy slimes only. The Slime King sent for me to ensure that that's the case. Like these tuxedo slimes. I killed one on accident, but this one, he can stick around. Oh, maybe he's a magician. That was, uh, that was a mistake, getting hit by all of that. I uh, probably should have been paying closer attention and not goofing around as hard as I was. Alright, now I actually gotta worry about staying alive here. Things are getting a little dicey. Would not mind... Would not mind some health. Let's try it. Let's sell a random item. Oh no, that's not what I wanted. Oh, but I lost my range anyways, so fuck it, who cares. I thought it was gonna sell the thing I was carrying. I guess it can sell my passive or actives. Maybe only passives. I don't entirely know that. I'm going to stop time. Fuck it. Well, I stopped time, but as soon as I attacked him, he was able to discharge me again. So shit. I guess that is the end of that. You can see I get to keep track of my stuff and everything, just like you would be usually used to seeing in Isaac. And not the most successful run. If, uh, if I would have made it further on this one single run, then I might have just said uh, one and done. I might still leave it as one and done for this game. I like these types of games. I don't know if it feels too much like what you guys have already seen a million times with Isaac, though, or if it feels new or interesting. I'm putting this in your hands. You guys are going to have to let me know. The title and, and thumbnail and everything are going to be set as this is a one-off episode. If people ask for more, then I will give you more. That's that's my feelings on the Slime King's Tower at the moment. Interesting game. Came out today, actually. You guys can go buy it on sale, 20% off. In Canada, I'm looking at the price, it's seven, it's like just under eight bucks on sale. It's just over six. So pretty reasonably priced. You guys can go check that out now. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again soon.